Okay, let's have a look at Ethereum, which may be entering a new bullish phase. It's quite similar to Bitcoin on the move, the move up from the beginning of April. I will go over that in a minute. Now, just look at the decline from January of this year through to April. It appears to be a three-wave correction down. I would look at it like this for three, a correction here, and then five waves here making a larger correction. And from that low, it looks like we have, or rather it has made a bullish impulse up. In Elliott Wave terms, it looks like a five wave impulse could be complete into today's high. That's not proven yet. So this count can change. The reason I print it is because it looks like there may be a bullish setup when a correction appears. So five waves up, as you can see printed, we won't go over that. What we want to see happen here is a correction begin, and when the pattern emerges, as long as it's three waves, like you see the Bitcoin video from earlier today for details of that, but something like this, or to go on the monthly, something like this, or not the monthly, the daily, rather. So we need to see a correction in order for this to prove that the first part of the impulsive move up is done. And then when that correction emerges, we can set up for a move higher. So in the near term, I would watch a level something like this to see how... price reacts on the way down. And if a level like this is broken, we can then look for a move back into this area for wave four. Now, it may extend higher from here. That's, you know, no one can know that yet. And that would change the count. One of these waves may be extending. So I will adjust that. But the point of this video is that when a correction emerges, if it's three waves in corrective, it will offer another buy setup. Unlike Bitcoin, um, the low into April was not suggestive of a turn, in my opinion. Bitcoin had a setup in um, April that there was a low from the February buildup. This did not have that, so it was a bit of a blind move. But we can work a bullish correction when something emerges down here. So that's what we want to see happen once a top is set in. So it looks like this is pretty good for a turn up. And we can then run the idea that the, a decline has completed into April. It will offer a buy setup and we can look for further advances. I cannot state a level. I don't know that, but we will look for further advances if a correction appears. And then perhaps we'll see a further decline in the future like is probably the preferred idea on Bitcoin. So if we, if we do get a correction in here, let's see another move up, and then perhaps in the future we can look for a larger turn down. I'm, I'm not sure at this stage if it's going to be more bullish than that or less bullish. I can only look for the local setup, but it does appear the bulls are back in control. So that's something to watch over the next few days and see if a correction can begin once the local trend is broken. And um, I'll leave it there. Any questions, let me know. Cheers.